Mr. Speaker, it was the week before Christmas, and Canadians were keen to witness a parliamentary nativity scene. There's lots of bad actors in this political fray, so I took up the task of casting this play. The Prime Minister thought there may be a chance, but said, first, let me check with the boys in short pants. <laughs> the kids all agreed. All our ministers are in. But when you look at the lineup, the talent's quite thin. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I, uh, I said, not, I said not to be mean or even unkind, but I don't think three wise men will be easy to find. <laughs> and the gifts they would bear, frankincense, frankincense, myrrh, and gold, will take 50 years to deliver, I'm told. <laughs> I then got an email from the PMO lads. We're going to promote it with action plan ads. <laughs> so. Joseph was a carpenter, a fixer of note. Our honourable speaker would garner my vote. <laughs> the cranky innkeeper who showed little heart. The government house leader might like that part. <laughs> <laughs> the good shepherd should be played by a brave and strong voice. Our sergeant at arms is the obvious yeah. choice. Yeah. <laughs> but who'll play the savior? God's only son. <laughs> How about someone born Christmas Day, 1971? Yeah! Uh, the honourable member.